Breaking news right now, a man is fighting for his life after a landscaping accident in Longwood. The man had to be pulled from a pond after his mower tipped over into the pond with the rider on it. This happened near South Seminole Hospital on West 2 News is the only organization that set that scene. Greg Fox is live there right now for us. And Greg, what can you tell us? Uh, the authorities and witnesses here at the uh, Longwood Plaza Business Center, which is along State Road 434 next to the hospital, are telling us that the man was cutting the grass here along the side of the retention pond. You can even see the cut line right there. It's got a bit of a slope, and the mower rolled into the retention pond. His co workers noticed that the wheel of the mower was sticking out of the water from the other side of the pond and ran over to pull him out. They immediately tried to revive him. All three work for a company called Design Landscaping Management, and the worker who went into the water uh, was riding on a bobcat, a large professional grade riding mower. Now, the co workers quickly got help from a handful of workers in the business center who rushed over to help perform CPR. There was about four, four employees, the citizens in the area, that took action, and uh, that's exactly what we need. As a community, for people to be observant and, and take action when needed, they did their best. Uh, we don't know the condition of the man right now. Well, once the Longwood Fire Department took over advanced life support, they transported the white male to South Seminole Hospital, where he was unresponsive at the time. The identity of the man is not being released. His family is being notified as he's getting emergency treatment at South Seminole Hospital, which, as I said, is just uh, around the corner from here. And again, just to recap, uh, he was riding on his mower along this kind of a gentle slope along this retention pond, and then apparently the bobcat just rolled into the water. He went in with it, may have been pinned under there partially or couldn't get out on his own, and his two co workers then pulled him out. He got CPR with the help of a lot of. Uh, uh, fast moving people around here in the business center, and he's being treated right now at the hospital. We'll, of course, update you on this story on West.com and on West 2 News. Live in Seminole County, Greg Fox, West 2 News.